Denny bike. A few years ago, Australian company Teague presented its design project for the Oregon Manifest competition, hoping to win a prize. Before designing it, the company's engineers wondered how to inspire a huge number of people to switch from cars to bicycles. The result of their thoughts, as well as many years of work, was the innovative smart bicycle Denny. It has a huge number of functions that make it different from other smart bikes. First of all, pay attention to the onboard computer, which is able to measure resistance and automatically switch gears, depending on the pressure the cyclist puts on the pedals. Not to mention the removable electric motor, which in a matter of seconds turns a traditional bike into an electric one. Thus, at any time, if the cyclist gets tired, he or she can activate the motor and continue riding without any extra effort. The handlebar has a very interesting design. With the flick of the wrist, it turns into a bicycle lock. It not only securely fixes the bike in place, but also makes it impossible for the thief to ride the bike. It's noteworthy that the bike has a light sensor that measures the level of light around and automatically adjusts the brightness of the headlights. In addition, Denny is equipped with very unusual fenders made of rubber bristles. They remove water from the wheel while driving in humid weather, protecting the cyclist from splashing. Bicycle. For many people around the world, a bicycle is not just a means of transportation. It's a way to keep yourself in good physical shape, eliminating the need to go to the gym very often. However, although the bike provides physical exercise, it doesn't stimulate all of your body. You only train the lower part, while the arms and the torso remain quite relaxed. Here we have the Twicycle, a bicycle that allows you to work out the muscles of the arms and upper body while driving. Its main feature is the presence of two chains, which makes it possible for you to use the bike in three different ways. The bicycle may be set in motion in the traditional way using your legs, the second mode is when the handlebar is used for driving, that is, the load on the legs is reduced, while the back, the chest, the abs, and of course the arms are working. But the third mode combines all that, and both arms and legs work simultaneously. The Twicycle is designed in such a way that the design of the handlebar changes from the traditional to the rotating mode in just a few seconds. Pay attention to the support made of soft material. It provides body support and protects the cyclist from direct contact with the front chain. Thus, the Twicycle is an amazing and effective exercise equipment that you can use even outside, enjoying the surroundings while exercising. The bike is already on sale, and you can buy it for $1,400. Elliptigo. Here is the first elliptical bike in the world. It was designed by professional athletes to become the perfect device for mixed workouts. Using Elliptigo allows you to train as if you were simultaneously running, riding a bicycle, and exercising on an elliptical trainer. Surprisingly, it allows you to burn 33% more calories than riding a traditional bike. Elliptigo was originally designed to help runners who have chronic injuries. The fact is that the unique design of this bike significantly reduces the load and the harmful effects on the joints. Today, Elliptigo can be bought by anyone who wants to get a fundamentally new experience of training in the open air. And although this vehicle is primarily a bicycle, it doesn't have a seat. When riding, instead of pedaling, the user alternately presses on the platform for the feet, and thanks to this, the bike moves forward. 
Elliptigo is convenient. People quickly adapt to its design and balance perfectly. It's noteworthy that the rider independently chooses the range of movement of the platforms, that is, the intensity of the training may be different. The cost of the Elliptigo depends on the model, ranging from $800 to $3,500. Flash. The manufacturers of the bike that you see on the screen initially set out to create a vehicle that would provide the optimal balance between freedom and safety while riding. And it just so happened that they eventually created one of the most advanced bikes in the world. The Flash bike is equipped with an electric motor and a rechargeable battery. It has a capacity of 500 watts and allows you to travel up to 80 kilometers on a single charge. Its maximum speed of movement is 28 km per hour. The road can be a dangerous place for a cyclist, so Flash was equipped with turn signals, lights that can be seen from any angle, as well as LED headlights. Interestingly, the bike is sensitive to movement. If it's left somewhere on the street in the defensive mode, it's almost impossible to steal it. When attempting to take it, the bike hits the intruder with a not-so-dangerous but sensible charge of electricity. While the lights turn on and the bike sends a warning signal to the owner's smartphone. The built-in GPS module is an advantage and allows you to always be aware of where the bike is. Its price varies from $2,000 to $2,600. Self-Driving Bicycle Danes have become famous throughout the world thanks to their love for bicycles. This is undoubtedly great, but this leads to more than 350,000 road accidents involving cyclists happening every year. That's why Google experts from the Netherlands started developing a bike which would be much safer, easier and more convenient to ride. As a result, they created a bike that can independently control its own movement. The vehicle that you see on the screen can determine where it is located, what surrounds it, and even presume what will happen to it in a short time. While working on the project, the experts turned to engineers who were engaged in the creation of self-driving cars. So the technology turned out to be similar, although it was provided with a couple of functional features. For example, the bicycle can be called to the right place using a special mobile application. And also, since it's able to move completely independently, you can even work while riding the bicycle. Well, did you really believe that? The video of the bike that we just showed was posted on March 31st, 2016, and it turned out to be an April Fool's joke from Google. However, considering that today there are already cars traveling without a driver, a future in which bicycles will not need a rider is very close. Bicycle technology today is actively developing. Innovations concern not only the internal device, but also external parameters. Experts create bikes that have an increasingly unusual appearance every year. Do you think the bikes of the future will really have something in common with these pictures, or will they be very different? Tell us in the comments below, and be careful on the roads.